Hey what's up guys, I wanted to keep this video pretty short and sweet. If you're running Windows and want to have a unlocked iPhone 2G or 3G, or if you just want the jailbreak, go ahead and check the links that are in the sidebar. There will be four links. Now if you're running Mac, please search for a 3.1 jailbreak Mac in YouTube or click the annotation that you see in front of you. For the first gen iPhone there will be a link for a unlocked and jailbroken version and then there will be a separate one that is just jailbroken. For the 3G, there will also be one like this, activated and jailbroken, and then just one for jailbroken. More info in the description, so make sure you check it out. The Ponage tool was released today by the dev team, but it was only released for Macs, which kind of sucked for us Windows users. But nevertheless, some iPhone users have been kind to share their custom restore IPSWs. I have already done this, as you can see. I am on 3.1. I still have the 4.26 uh, modem firmware and uh, can't really tell that I'm unlocked on T-Mobile because um, I'll explain that right now. Anyways, once you download um, your correct firmware that you need, either unlocked and jailbroken or whatever, make sure you back up everything. And by everything I mean your photos, your notes, anything from apps that you may need, or maybe a list of city applications that you want to reinstall, you know, Winterboard, uh, QTweeter, iReal SMS, just something to remember. Because for this 3.1 jailbreak, you will need to restore. So Windows users, of course, you're obviously going to hit Shift Restore, and then you're going to select the IPSW that um, you downloaded. And wherever you save to that desktop, I recommend saving it to the desktop. And then you'll go ahead and restore, and as you can tell, I have restored and lost all my application settings and stuff. And also, when it asks you to set up your phone, make sure you set it up as new. And my last note before I go, make sure you read the Ultra Snow blog post again to download it, link in the sidebar. Make sure to make sure that you follow the directions to follow it, like make sure you have 3G off, uh, you don't insert the SIM card too early. And um, there will also, like I had previously said, there will be no carrier name if you're using T-Mobile. Don't think like your phone is messed up or you screwed up on something. I obviously, as you can see, have the same palm. It only has the bars and the Wi-Fi status. It doesn't say T-Mobile. Um, Muscle Nerd from the dev team has already said that it is normal and um, basically just be thankful that the bars are there. Um, well, um, that's pretty much it, guys. If you have any problems with jailbreaking and unlocking, go ahead and follow me on Twitter and send me an at reply with your question or you uh, feel free to comment below. Thanks.